Derek here from Hooked on Fishing for Real. Nice, cool, overcast day. I was here fishing. I didn't have my camera set up, so I immediately ran to my truck to get my camera set up. I just hooked into a nice size uh, snook, so I thought, I thought I'd share it with you guys. So here it is. I'm, I'm, tr I'm trying to still reel it in, so uh, give me time, guys. He had went underneath the dock here, and I had to uh, pull him off from underneath the dock. Here he is right here. Let's see if I can pull him up here. Oh, that's a nice slot size. Biggest snook I ever caught, guys. If I can get down, I wore him out. Let me see if I can get down and get him here. He's tired. Let's see here. Actually, I'll have to walk him back to the... Uh, tell you what, guys. We'll walk him down here. Tell you what, guys. Come on. We're going to walk him down here so you guys can see this. I'll walk him down this way so you guys can see him. He's a big one. I have to come down this way. This is the only way I can pull him up. They're out of season, so I can't keep him, but I want to share it with you guys. So I'm going to come all the way down this way and pull him up right here so you guys can see it. All right. That way you guys can see me pull him in. This is the biggest snook I ever caught right here. Check this out. I'll pull him in for you guys. He's tired. There he is. I caught him really close to these mangroves over here. I'll let him go here in a few minutes. There we go, guy. Guy, I'll let you go here in a few minutes. I just want to share you with the... <sighs> Look at this, guys. Biggest snook I ever caught. Look at that. That's a giant. That's probably about a, uh, I don't know, 30-incher, 40-incher. I'm going to let him go, though. There you go. All right, he made it. Woo, yay! <laughs> he made it, guys. Man, that was a big snook. Big snook I ever caught. I didn't exactly measure him because uh, I wanted to just hurry up and get him back in the water. But, man, he hit this. I'll show you guys what he hit. I was throwing this trick shot here. and Man, he, uh, he slayed it. He slayed this thing, guys. Um, get it all set back up here how I had it. But yeah, I threw it near the mangroves and he hit it. This is what he hit, guys. He hit this thing right here. That right there. That's what he hit. All right, I had to go to my car and get uh, some more of those uh, trick shots. Um, TRD finesse. Here's what they look like, guys. This is the uh, fire crawl color. This is what I caught that snook on. I caught that snook on this color right here. And you can see it's an overcast day right now. Uh, but like I said, this, I just threw this right over there near those mangroves and uh, he was sitting there waiting on it. And uh, man, he came out and attacked that thing right away. So I'm going to put another one on here and see what else is lurking over there near those mangroves. That was a big snook. I'm surprised that they're, they're out here, but they, they are definitely out here. That's for sure. Well, it doesn't seem anything's hitting this uh, TRD anymore, so I'm going to call it quits. It is getting a little chilly out here. I didn't anticipate being out here this long. I thought I would just be out here for an hour, but I caught that nice snook, and it kind of rejuvenated some energy in me to stay out here a little bit longer. Anyway, that's going to be a wrap for me. Uh, come back out here another day. All right, guys. Yeah, that's going to be a wrap for me. Uh, I apologize for the short video, but uh, I just had to share it with you guys. Um, caught me off guard. I didn't think I was going to catch anything today and caught that nice size uh, slot snook. And I'm going to say he was probably about 35 inches long. I didn't get a chance to measure him, but just from the look of it, you guys can tell that was a nice uh, size snook. 
Too bad they're not in season, right? <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button below and be sure to click that bell notification so that you'll be automatically notified when I post new video content. And as always, guys, if you like this video, much love and appreciate it if you hit that like button. I hope you get value out of this and helping you improve your fishing knowledge. That's all I have for you today. Until next time, peace.